Hello, First Baptist Crawford. It's good to be with you, and I'm here in the sanctuary. It's quiet and it's empty. Oftentimes during the week so far, I've come in and uh, sat for about five minutes, and I will just sit and pray. Then I'll reflect on the two Sundays we've had together and look forward to the many Sundays that we have to come in which we can worship the Lord and think on Scripture together. And recently I've been pondering, meditating on a scripture, James chapter 1, verse 5, which I mentioned this past Sunday in the sermon. And it says, If any of you lacks wisdom, you should ask God, who gives generously to all without finding fault, and it will be given to you. And really my prayer recently has been for the Lord to grant me wisdom as your new pastor and to, uh, to walk with me as I learn Crawford and I learn about many of you and learn your histories and learn about your walks with the Lord. And I pray that the Lord would grant you wisdom in this interesting time that we live in. In this Sunday, we'll talk a little bit more about wisdom and what wisdom has to do with loving God and loving others as we dive into Mark chapter 12 and Jesus's instruction there to love God and to love others and how that is the greatest commandment. So I'd ask that you continue to pray for me, that the Lord would give me wisdom, and I continue to pray for you, that the Lord would grant you wisdom each and every day. And I look forward to diving into Mark chapter 12 this Sunday. God bless you.